Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. You guessed it, it's another buddy plan with Darshell from Books mm -hmm. and Planners. So you've already seen or hopefully you've watched our first mm -hmm. set from last week on her channel, but this week we are doing the Daydreams kit. This is a really old mystery kit from Sweet Quiet Design. I want to say it was last spring. Like it was a long time ago. Yeah. It's been a while. Yeah. So, Darshell was actually subscribed to the kit when it was actually like coming out every month. I had the chance to pick it up when Tasia did a release of all of the old mystery kits, which was really awesome because she released any of the mystery kits that had been released. She essentially put them up on the shop for like what a weekend or something. It was like Black Friday, wasn't it? Or something like that. Maybe, yeah. It was just like. I bought a couple of them too. That it was I just had like a got. quick time yeah. and they were discounted. Right? I want to say that they were fairly priced. Yeah. I don't know. I don't remember. Either I'm, way, it doesn't matter. They were, but we they were discounted because I bought like three of them. And I know I didn't spend $75. Yeah. yeah they were discounted. Because this is one that I made that almost made me sign up for the mystery sub subscription kit when it first came out because, I mean, hmm. unicorns and stars it's pretty and rainbows. <laughs> um, and I didn't pick it up. So I'm glad that I did because I've been hoarding it ever since and now we get to use it. So Yay. I'm just going to flip through the different pages. And this is kind of like the first time that I'm looking through it also because like. It, I've been hoarding it in my binder <laughs> and I keep seeing you know every month or so someone will use it and I'm like oh my goodness I have that <laughs> I need to use it look at all the little fitness unicorns it's, it's been a really long time since she's had like fitness elements in her yeah kit I think she took it out to make it like a little more universal uh -huh. and then has like the fitness add-ons but I have I have plenty of leftover fitness from the old ones so I like I mean I incorporate little Fitness animals every once in a while. Look at that. I know. Washi. Oh, the, the washing the full goodness. box is like the best part about the whole thing. Oh. It's so okay. pretty. So now that we're jazzed to get into this, let's Ooh. start planning. <laughs> All right. So I, yeah, I have used this kit already once. So I have some missing stickers, but... I have like all my sidebar stuff because when I used this, it was in an A5 and I don't think I had a sidebar in it. That's why I was like, oh, how do I use all this stuff? So I still have plenty of stickers left. I remember so, back when you did this. Yeah. I don't know if I was following it was, you on YouTube at that point. It was or... in the summer. I remember that because that's when I was kind of trying out. Well, then, yeah, I was inserts. definitely following you on yeah. YouTube at that point. It was shortly after I think we first met, like when we first got together. Because how many times... Oh, my whiteout's being stupid. Do you need some? No. That's all right. It just sometimes gets caught. It's like, okay, I got some. No, thank you, though. You know what? I'm actually going to go with the page flex because they match. They do match. The purple match. <laughs> and really, you could keep the green on here, too. Oh, yeah. If you yeah. have the colorful. Yeah, that green matches actually pretty well. These are all, like, pastel rainbow what wonderfulness. What do first? I'm gonna do my bottom washi. Yeah, that was the most like upsetting thing when I decided to use this in that A5 um, in the A5 inserts was because I realized I didn't have a place for bottom washi. And I was like, <gasps> no, no was it's like, so I beautiful. Love this part. Yeah, so I'm really glad that I get to use the bottom washi. I was trying to think back. Was the first time we met at Starbucks and yes. then we yes. got more people? And I, we met like last May. I'll have to go back and look because it's in my planner. I'm pretty sure. It is in mine too. Because I was like all excited I could finally use the planner girl. Yeah, like, and then like sticker. Yeah, and then like and the, then like a we month had later. Someone that lived yes. close. Yes. It was like a month later that we met up with Marissa and Shelby. Yes. And did our little planning at Sombreros and I think all the Sombreros patrons thought we were nuts. We did have that one lady come up and be like, I'm sorry to interrupt, but what are you guys doing? <laughs> We're like planning. Come join oh, us. That was so much fun because we planned for 4th It of was July. a good time. Yes. Yes, we did. That's because that's when I first started using my traveler's notebook because I used, I, I was like completely didn't know what to do. Yep. Oh, man. That seems like so long ago. I know. Going down I know. I can't believe summer kits are going to start coming out anytime now. I know. Tasia just did really like good. a sneak peek on her Instagram. Oh, really? Yeah. June monthly Oh, I haven't seen it yet. I'll have to go in there and look. It's very bright, very stripey. I loved her monthly, I can't remember if it was June or what it was last year. Um, the one that was super bright and had like 
the crabs. Oh, yeah. That was, I like, my that favorite. Those June. bright, bold colors. And it had, like, it did. It had the crabs for everything. I yes. still use those. I had uh, a bunch of, like, Bildu crabs. Yeah, yeah, I do, too. <laughs> it was, that was a fun kit. All right, I'm going to learn from last time. I'm going to take my stuff I don't need and set it off to the side. Yes. <laughs> All right, I gotta do these day covers before I get my days completely wrong here. So I'm gonna be like completely surprised if anyone has this kit and is able to like plan with us on this one. Some people might hoard it like me. I know. I did. I was like, did we start with the 25th? Sorry to interrupt really quick. Yes. Okay. I'm on an old calendar, so I don't know what the days are. Oh, I have it over here. Never mind. My bad. That's why I opened my planner so I'm to ask you. <laughs> That's okay. Anyway. But yeah, I mean, if anybody has this, that'd be super fun if you're planning with us. Or it doesn't really matter. Grab any kit. No, yeah. And plan with us. That's what I think. I don't know. Some of you guys have said that you just grab whatever. And like, I, I was actually really happy to hear that people are actually planning along with us. I know. That makes it more fun. Well, I think it's cool too to like, I like to watch, like if I'm not filming and I'm just planning and like... Like mindlessly. Yes. I like having Plan With Me's playing in the background because actually sometimes I get inspiration or pick up on stuff. Mm -hmm. So. And actually, yeah, like I love watching Tasia's Plan With Me's. That's how it got me started. But, um, like she always has ideas and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm going to do that this week. Right. Well, because everyone just sees oh, things a little bit differently, story? you know? Yeah, for sure. This Tuesday does not want to happen. <laughs> Whatever, straight enough. Well, and then I remember, <gasps> I don't know who it was, but they're like, oh, I'm totally stealing that idea from you. It's a good idea. I don't remember what the idea was. And I was, was like, Was it me well, in your clouds? <laughs> well, hey, you, but yeah, someone else has done the same thing. And I'm like, well, it's not really stealing because I probably took it from you someone else. You probably got it, yeah, somewhere else. Like, like, we all just see things a little bit differently. Like, the only reason I know what to do with any planner stickers is because I've watched other people do it. Right. But yeah, I, I, I like, I'd like to say I've found my groove with planning, because, I mean, like, a certain, like, style now, but I do switch it up every now and then, so. I don't know. I'm really happy with where I'm at right now. Yeah. I've done, well, because, like, the last time we got together, we did one of the Michaels kits. Yes. And, like, that was out of both of our elements. That was the video we were very quiet, because we were very oh. focused. <laughs> there was no chit-chat, because you couldn't. Because every time you went to go do something, you're like, oh, is that really what Hold I want to do? Hold your breath. Put the sticker like, down. Is this going to work? <laughs> but, yeah. yeah. That one was definitely challenging for us, but I think it's good. Keeps it entertaining. And then, like, no more than, what, like, maybe the week after, I think, that I planned with some of the stickers from Simply Gilded. Was that the one where you did, like, yeah, all kind of random I, stickers? I, like, mixed Coffee Monsters Co. with Sweet Quiet Design yeah. with Simply Gilded. Yeah. I have had... I it looks good. I thought by the end of the week... So, when you first posted it, I was like, okay, you're like, what, what are you this? doing? Where is this going? <laughs> and number one, I knew that wasn't you. And I'm like, what is she doing? She's a creature of habit. And then, yeah, when you post your final spread, it looked so good. You I was really, really... pulled that together. I was really happy. I put it down, and I remember looking at my husband, and I was like, this is... This is a hot, hot mess. <laughs> this is worse than I've ever done. I hate every, oh, like, so every part of it, but... No, as soon as, like, each day got more filled up, I was like, oh, okay, emojis do go with little chubby Simons, and yeah. chubby little Simons <laughs> do go with Simply Gilded Bows. I, okay. That's funny. Okay, I gotta be kind of strategic about my full boxes. Actually, let me do my headers first. Do you have any cool plans for this week? It's no. Kind of well, far away. my stitch fix comes in Ooh, on Friday. So that's kind of fun because I only get them every quarter now and I budget so much per month that, uh -huh. so that way when it rolls around I have like a chunk of money. It's usually not enough to get everything in the box, but I usually don't like everything anyways. Right. Um, if I do, sometimes I kind because you get a discount if you keep all the stuff. Right, so sometimes, okay. it, sometimes I have enough and it works out. But I'm really trying to like not be like, screw it and spend extra. I'm trying to really stick to what I have saved right. for clothing, you know? 
Um, so yeah, I only get it every quarter now and I'm really excited because it's been since December that I got my last one and so this is gonna be like my spring box. I, I asked, asked. <laughs> I asked for a lot of like fun like spring clothes and I need some new like flats that are I don't know, cute but comfortable. Mm -hmm. So I don't I don't always get shoes, but I requested them this time just because I feel like I don't really have any good warm weather shoes. Because I don't know, I just don't. That aren't tennis <laughs> shoes. I have tons of boots, like winter I'm covered because I love wearing boots and leggings or skinny jeans or whatever. But in summer I just never know. Besides old, good old flip flops. You had good luck with Stitch Fix. I love it. This is like my 12th box. I've been I doing it for years. did it for like three months straight you, and hated everything. Yeah, you told me that. Like my first box was amazing and then I, I've given them feedback and every time they've just kind of tweaked it and there's been some where I'm like, okay, I only like one thing. They've like, they've totally missed. Mm -hmm. But I found a stylist that I really like and so now I request her every time. Right. So my well, little note, I'm like, hey, if I can have Chelsea again, that'd be great. And so she's right. always like, hey, Rochelle, I'm glad to be styling you again, you know. So she's, and I feel like, and I give them inspiration. Like I love Candace Cameron Bray and she's so like classic uh -huh. and simple with her style. And I told them that. And so like the last couple I've really liked. And maybe that was part of my problem is like, I don't really, I don't know. I don't really have a style. <laughs> I need more work. Well, and that could be part of it too is like, you just don't. And do you have like a Pinterest board with like clothing on it? Oh no. So, cause I have a Pinterest board and you can link it to your Stitch Fix. So they can go look at I what you I knew that, like. but I definitely don't. Oh, like... it, oh, it works so well. Okay, what am I gonna, so there's a lot of these kind of full boxes in here. So many. Um, so I don't know if I just, and oh, there's those. But these you can layer on really easily. Right. I like that a lot. Especially with these I'm trying to see what all full uh, boxes half boxes, I have here. because they're not colored. I don't think they're just, they just have, they all have the, oh yeah, the rainbow color. So it's like, they're going to blend in, but not really blend in. Right. So yeah, like, like the whole There's not is. too many quote boxes. So I think I might just kind of keep it with this theme mm -hmm. and then put a quote up at the top. Okay. Let's... Oh, Bill, do stickers. These ones are like kind of random. <laughs> Those boxes. Yeah. Well, but they work. Okay. So I think I'll just put. Where, where was I going with this? Sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I interrupted <laughs> you, like your thought process. Anywho, but yeah, so I have Stitch Fix coming. My my CPR is due, which is due quarterly at work, and my CPR is due on the 31st. And the only reason that I get excited about doing my CPR now is because I have a sticker from Once More With Love of little munchkins <laughs> doing CPR. <laughs> And I have a whole sheet of them and I only need to use four a year. So it makes me really excited. So that's one way to look forward to having to do something like that is have a fun sticker for it. Quarterly seems excessive. It's ridiculous. We have to do the mannequin and then we have to do a test every year and the mannequin every three months. And my new job doesn't recognize American Heart Association. Association. What? Ugh. So we have to do that. So my old job, I still have to go get my American Heart Association card every year or every two years. So it's like I have to double up on CPR. Right. So if, if something happens to you, yeah, I'm really I'm, I feel safe right I'm now. I'm extra qualified. Oh my goodness. It's very, very ridiculous. That just, that does seem excessive. Okay, so do I want to yeah. use cloud checklist or not cloud checklist? I'm trying to decide do I want to use long checklist or do I want to use short <laughs> checklist? I don't know. Well, I'm not doing the short, so there's that. This was back when she, I mean, the kits are so different now than They're, what yeah, they were. They are. I think I'm just going to keep up this alternating thing because I don't really know. I feel like this kit is, you can do so many things with it. And I just feel like with these boxes, they're so easy to layer. Whereas like the quilt boxes or the characters, right. you really can't. You did have to So be... you can add so much to these. You have to be more strategic, but with this, I mean, For sure. the layout, yeah, but not. Oh, this is not straight, and that's gonna drive me crazy. I think it's because the header's not straight. Probably because the date cover's not straight. Oops. Do you love that? Ah, uh, just like drives me nuts. But at least you can remove them. Right. <laughs> I think because of that, I'm like more carefree when I'm planning with her stickers because I'm just like, eh, come up. Whereas like if I'm using other shops, it's like, 
I just have to like really be sure and I take a little bit longer. Well, and like, oh God, so we even so talked wicked. about it a little bit because we were originally, we were originally planning to do this last night. And by that point, like, <laughs> yeah, I know that you had already had it in your planner because I saw it yes. and I already had it in my planner. Um, and we were talking about it like it's not a big deal to move because it worked out anyway, but... My hubby got sick and it would not have been pleasant for anybody. No, it's still that time of year. The flu is like... He had like stomach flu. Like it was Ugh. almost like food poisoning. It hit him like level. Saturday. But see, my friend came over and we made chicken and like asparagus. Like we made a healthy meal. Uh-huh. And I was like, it's not the chicken because I'm fine. Right. She, she had like four pieces and she's fine. Like it wasn't that. So he just must have got some weird bug. And luckily I didn't get it. I think just because I'm around it so much. So I'm more immune right. to like catching stuff. Um... Yeah, he was, like, violently ill, like, uh, Sunday morning, and I thought maybe if it was food poisoning, it would go away, or if he just ate something that didn't sit right, right it would go it away. Would be done. No, it was, like, all day, so he called in Sunday, and then Sunday night, he was just, like, having chills and a fever, and I'm like, oh, boy, and he's like, I don't think I'm gonna go to work tomorrow, so that's when I messaged you, I was like, so here's the deal. Yeah. And it was totally cool, like... That's why I was like, if, if you don't have any other days, like, we can make it work, but... No, it worked out I was out so fine. glad that you had today free. Well, and then we were talking about it, like, do we, do we move our stickers at that point? Because, yeah, we could. I know, I thought about just, like, picking it up, which I, I kind of did. I think I moved my little planning critter people over, but I, you know... I don't know. I just... I had written... I had written yet. I had written in it, so I was like, well, I'm... I don't have and another you, red full box to go in yeah. that day, so I was like, I'd either have to, like, put something else down, yeah. or, you know what, just you know, slap the rescheduled sticker on it, and that's what I did. The only reason that I had not written on it is because I forgot to bring my permanent marker to work on Sunday night with me, because, you know, I told you I was a hot mess on Sunday and uh -huh. forgot half my lunch. Yeah, I also forgot to switch my pens out to my permanent marker, well. and so I was like, I have nothing to write on my planner with, so I said, you know, I'm just going to wait until I get home, and then that's when I messaged you, so, yeah, it worked out. Okay, so I was going to put my to-do list in the middle. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try something completely different. I'm going to put them at the bottom. Ooh. I know. I'm kind of nervous. Like, I've never done this before. Hmm. It'll work out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it will because... I know. I just got to figure out, like... I don't know. I've never done that. But I'm just thinking, like, I have my uniform fitting, but it's not till like, nighttime. And I was going to put it here. But then it's, like, that's not... Like at the but I mean, but I, it's day. so weird because I work nights. I know. So it's kind of like the start of my day because I'm doing it before I go to work. But I feel like I'm going to start that and then put my other stuff here. So I don't want it up there. I don't know. Right, with the checklist in the middle breaking that up. Yeah. Yeah. I get that. I want this cute little pink weekend banner. Okay, so I, I don't want that. What am I going to put at the bottom then? Because I don't want that gap there. I'm going to put this down with the anticipation of throwing down some washi underneath that when there I get home. home. Um, okay, so I do have, I'm going to use the meal plan sticker because I never use this. I'm going to use the meal plan and a weekly schedule over here. So I don't need meals. I kind of miss. I kind of want to work down there. When she had the meal plans in there every week, I was using them. Mm -hmm. And then when and she then got she rid of them, away. and I was like, okay, I don't need it. But now that I, like, I see yeah. them here and I'm like, oh man, I remember. Okay, so Listen, if I... I remember when it was I remember like when. <laughs> I'm going to see if I have enough quarter boxes to do all my work. Because i got to have color blocked. Yellow. It's blue. Well, there are a few more. I was like, there's not, like, hardly any oh, quarter I boxes. I need to have one more pink just in case I'm working that day. But I do know that I have quarter boxes. I know, but it's not, like, the same. These are very, very similar, though. Yeah, because I'm going to be one pink short. That's a good idea. Let me look and see if I have one of the matches. I just have to I know. Remember. I got inspired, I think, maybe by you yeah. and color and sorted everything. I yeah. don't do it by color, but okay, I do it by... Okay, somebody posted that. I was like, oh, good idea. I do it by item. Yeah, I did have it by item, and then I sorted them, and it was the best thing in the world. So these are... I don't have a pink that matches. I got all the these pinks. $2 Tuesday quarter boxes from 1010 mm -hmm. are pretty dang close. Well, I'm trying to think how else I could do my work schedule. Like, I may just pull this sheet and just keep it. 
You know what? I don't know. We're, what pink do you need? This, this one. But there's only two of them, so. I don't that one's one. like as close as it gets. Do you want one? Yeah. No, that's okay. Because extras. I'm supposed. I signed up to work this Sunday night, but we have this new policy at work that starts on Sunday. And I don't know if I'm going to be working now because we're not supposed to have overtime. I don't know. I'm so confused because, like, there's nobody else to work it, which is why I'm working it. But now we can't have overtime, so I'm like, so am I, am I not working it? I feel like I'm going to end up working it, but right. you don't I don't know. Mark it down. I'll just leave it off, and if I end up working it, I'll just put a different color on there and just call it good because they need to get their shit together. You know, I mean, obviously I'm a planner, and that is, like, my biggest pet peeve. <laughs> It's just not knowing my plans. And like, they're trying to change up the way we do our schedule in April. And I'm like, I have two jobs and I'm already working at my other job. So if you guys are gonna make changes, you know, I, I gotta know. Right, like ahead of time. Yeah. Cause you, you're lucky. Like, I feel like your schedule is uh, like a month out. You know what nights you're working. I already picked up a shift in July at my second job. See? Because the hours were so sparse that they had 4th of July open and I'm off at my my full-time job. So I was like, oh, I'll take it because it's holiday pay, you know? And I knew if I didn't jump on it that somebody else would. Right. So I like, if I want a shift, I have to grab it quick because I can't wait to see what my schedule is going to be like at one job. It's, it's frustrating. I came home today and did relaxing yoga. I did calming <laughs> yoga. Yoga to calm your nerves, I think is what it was called. And I was like, yeah, that's, that's going to happen. Okay, I, do I want to do this round? So, I shit you not, I have three meetings on Monday. And so I thought about not even putting them down. What if you did like um, a, a check, uh, there's these important checklists. Could you do important? <gasps> and like write your meetings in there? Yes. Sorry, I should show everybody else instead of you. Yes. Because I saw that and I was like, oh, that would be kind of cool if I had like three things to do in a day instead of a checklist. Oh my but. goodness. And then you can thank just you, put, thank you, no problem. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, yeah and then, then you I can just write put, your meetings in. Yeah, no, that works. I was, I was like, yay, yay. And I only have, this is this is the amount that I have of meeting stickers. See, like, I think about things that I'm like, that'll never happen. No, no, but if it did I have happen, a whole other sheet. But yeah, yeah. I don't, that was just going to waste my entire day. Yeah. Now I can waste it in a better way. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm just like thinking, like, how would I use that important sticker, you know? Because, mm -hmm. like, I don't have, like... I like using the top three um, in my sidebar, but I'm just like, how would I use that important one? See, so. and I think I just mentally just skipped over that page. That part, yeah. Because I'm like, I don't use any of right. these. Oh, that's I mean, I usually perfect. like to put a quote box, but... See, I even put it away in my, like, trash, oh, don't yeah. use. Yeah, if she doesn't have... If she has the top three stickers, I'll use it just because I feel like I'm not going to use it anywhere else, so... So like I did for this week, I used it. And so I put like my haircut and then planning with you and I don't have a third thing, but <laughs> I have top two. Yeah, no, I have meetings like all day. And I, I, I know I've talked about this, like playing around with, do I even want to put my meetings down in this planner? Cause I have my work planner, but what then- What do you use for your work planner? I can't remember. I use a happy planner. Oh, that's right. Yeah, because you're... The this. But you know power, what? There's something working? satisfying about just, like, ripping that bad boy out and, like, slapping it down and yes. being like, dude. That's why, that's why I went to the... Like, that's why I do the A5 um, with my Aaron Condren, because I, I love being able to take it out, me and that coil. But you know what? I've been thinking... Hmm, I was like, when she releases the new ones in, like, May or whatever mm -hmm. they come out, I'm really thinking about trying to get an hourly coil planner again and trying it but I'm like I know it's not gonna last I'm, I'm gonna get pissed and I'm gonna rip them out and punch them <laughs> which is stupid because you're paying a lot of money just to take something apart you right. know so I have plenty of these pages left to get me through like till summer and then I just bought the guts for like five dollars from another girl like of a half of a year right so I have plenty to get me through but man just like new planner season it just I know it's gonna make me want to buy a new one. Oh, for sure it does with everyone yeah I'm really excited for the release because I don't think there's been any sneaks on like the new Erin Condren I styles seen, I haven't no. seen anything surface yet I'm waiting for her to come out with the Hobonichi weeks oh because she, she's kind of been a, behind the times with it because like traveler's notebooks were real big right and then like a year later she came out with the petite planners so it's like it was right, kind of just right. like a little bit delayed 
So, but I'm wondering if she's gonna like get on the ball and like have a Hobonichi Weeks pop up, you know, <laughs> oh. before June. I could just see him having some type of Hobonichi something. Something, yeah. They'll call it something different. Right. Okay, well, I'm gonna put an expletive saying there. There you go. It's not that I, I don't even mind meetings, but. Oh, there they are, right beside me. When my whole day is just feels like it's meetings back to back, like. Yeah. Why not put a holy shit sticker? That's that's actually appropriate. That's not. There you go. So I'm trimming my little checklist because they don't quite fit with the, but they fit good if there's only four. Four, yeah. That's what I love about these is that you can trim them very easily and they work. Holy shit. There we <laughs> go. That's All awesome. right. What do I have going on the next day? Grocery store taking out the trash. That's it. That's all I'm doing. We have nothing else. So that's done. I'm really liking this. I I don't know if it's just like my stress level or whatever, but this like structured planning style has really been my thing the last few weeks. Well, because well, it makes you weeks. feel probably just in control of it, everything. I think that's what it is. Like, I, I love when I kind of, like, stagger everything. Like, I like the way it looks. But then when I'm actually, like, planning in it, it kind of stresses me a little right. bit. Like, it's more pressure to, like, make stuff fit and work. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. But, like, when I look at my planner and everything's, like, has its spot and is really structured. Why is that different? Or shall... Oh, because my bottom washi is wrong. Thank you for removable stickers. <laughs> Anyways, I was like, why is that higher? But yeah, so like I was saying, when everything has its place, it just it makes me happy. Well, it's like you know what to expect with it too. Right. Where did I, how did I line this one up? Oh, I lined it up with this line. That's why. Believe in your dreams. Do I put that down? I think I do. Believe in your dreams. Yeah, this kit was so pretty. So part of it is like, uh, some of the mystery kits I haven't even touched yet because, and like the ones I bought on Black Friday or whatever, she re-released re them. Mm -hmm. I haven't even touched them because they're so pretty. I don't want to like, know. I don't want them to be gone because it's like, who knows if they'll come back, you know? Well, I, I hoarded these like specifically for so long because one, I think it was in the fall when these came out. It was. I remember it was the fall because I got them like, it was before the end of the year Um, because I got the... I bought the mystery kits that start that happened before I joined the mystery because I think I started getting mystery kits probably about a year ago, probably last March, mm -hmm. and um, I got the like little forest friends one because mm -hmm. that was that came out before I started getting it, and then what else did I get? Can you? I know the forest one because I keep seeing it. But I have a feeling that she will do that sale again this year because with all the people that missed out on the B kit that wanted it, like oh, she's yeah. had, because the Michael stuff kind of happened right after, right? Or right around that time. So oh I yeah, definitely she, I feel after. like she got so many more yeah. followers and more people in the group and people are like, oh my gosh, how do I get that kit? Where's that kit at? And that's, I think that's why she released that one. Mm -hmm. But I feel like if she did like a throwback kawaii kit or whatever, um, she would do really well on it because I feel like a lot of people that joined after, you know, would right. soak it up. I agree. That's why I'm wondering if us posting this, there's going to be people in the group that are like, where is that? We kit? want this kit. I know. Yeah. I'm so sorry to everyone. Because I haven't really seen this <laughs> kit surface it. for a while. Like I haven't seen anybody use it for a while. I have just like, it really is like once a month, someone will post it and be like, I'm using leftovers from this. I'm like, <gasps> Oh, it's That's so funny. pretty. I know, I have so many kits to use and it's just like, it's kind of overwhelming. So that's when you suggested this. I was like, good, I don't have to make a choice. I was gonna tell you, why don't you just pick a kit and I'm sure I have it and we'll just go from there. <laughs> cause I'm really good about buying new kits but I'm really bad about using my old ones cause I don't want them to go away. So okay, Wednesday. Now what am I doing? I don't have a day yet that I've picked to go to Sunshine Nutrition, so maybe I should do that on Wednesday. She works on go. Wednesday. There's like little critters and scrubs, right? Aren't they like nursing critters? Yeah. I don't think I have them. There has to be. But remember... for my uniform fitting, that would be so appropriate. Yeah, and I know I don't have any. I, I have 
scrub characters in other shops. Right. So I can use that. But I was just like, I know there is a nursing one. I just didn't get it because there was a whole nurse. I'm not a nurse. Kit, like nurse week. Yeah, I'm not a nurse. So like a lot of the like when people do like I don't know scrub stuff, it's, it's geared towards nursing. Right. And it, I'm like, yeah, that's not me. So anyway, um, so yeah, I don't really need a whole sheet of them, but I have I have um, fox and cactus little scrub girls and I never use them yeah there she is oh and I can use the pink one purple oh those are so cute I love them her little and her have you ever bought any of her little character you have bought any no yeah. okay I haven't so yet her characters come in all different like hairstyles I have seen that so I get this her this one's name is Rose she's got like brunette or like brunette that was hair. the one I was gonna but get but when I, I got like out. her oops bag I grabbed they were all out of the brunette so I grabbed the blonde ones because I've kind of let my hair go yeah. a little bit natural and whatever it doesn't matter but she'll release like colorful hair ones and I love them I love like the cotton candy hair girls but I'm like that will never be my hair. I know, but... But they're so cute. I've got a couple purple girl hair ones that came in, like, oops bags as well. Sometimes I wish... I wish my hair could be... I know, me too. Um, my hairstylist keeps telling me about Overtone. Have you seen, like, the ads for Overtone? Mm -hmm. But it's like, I looked on there, and it's all funky colors. Like, you can't just use, like, a brown to make your hair. You know, it's right. all, like, blue or purple or pink. And it's fun, don't get me wrong, but I can't do that. <laughs> Even if it is temporary. <laughs> but it's so fun. I wish I could do it. Okay, so I think... All right, Friday my stitch fix comes. Yay! I have kindergarten transition meetings on that Wednesday. But this week just looks like not fun at all. <laughs> so I'm going to use that same style again. I will never use this, I swear, ever again in my life. Because I'll like never have it happen. I think I want to put headers underneath the full box because I don't want it. I don't want that line showing. I hate that dotted line. I think that's okay with me if it goes above the header. That looks okay. And possibly. Oh, your smoothie? Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. I think it looks kind of cute that way. I don't remember if I bought those blenders. I think. Um, I think I added them to my cart and then I ended up not getting them because like I was on a smoothie kick for a while. I did this like cleanse thing to like jumpstart. It was like at the beginning of the year mm -hmm. and it was like basically like you get it's like whole foods like fruits and vegetables basically and so I was making smoothies a lot because that's kind of was kind of the easiest way to get my protein in and everything else. And I was like, oh, I need to buy these. And then I think when I went to purchase, like, I was kind of phasing out. Like, I was so yeah. sick of it because I had been doing it for so many days that I don't think I bought them. But I need to just so I have them. Because every once in a while I make a smoothie. They're just easy. Yeah. You know? Like, uh -huh. and then it takes time to, like, drink it. And you're like, the next thing you know, it's been forever. I know, I keep saying, maybe I'll do it tonight. I keep saying I'm gonna make one um, because it's easy to kind of like make and then take and drink on the way to work or whatever. Because mm -hmm. I've tried to make them and like throw them in the freezer and they're just not as good later. No, they're not the, it's not the same. No, but I just haven't wanted to lately because it's been so cold that I don't oh, want right. to walk into work carrying something cold in my hand. So. So my friend Kayla yeah. told me like, you should be eating breakfast within 30 minutes of waking yeah, up. Yeah, no. That which is like, happen. that's really hard for me. Because one, if I was eating breakfast every day, that was, that I mean, was like going to be great. Sometimes I do, but like it's so weird because like I wake up in the afternoon. <laughs> and sometimes right. I eat breakfast food, but it's usually, I'm, if I want to get stuff done, I have to get up and go. Be like, because doctor's offices are closing and it's just. Well, that makes sense. So it's like, I don't have time to like sit here and make breakfast and eat breakfast and whatever. But usually, like, I'll run my errands, and then I'll come home and eat, so. But I have been trying to do my, like, glass of water when I wake up. Or, um, like, I was doing warm water with a lemon for a while. It's supposed to be, like, a good detox. Mm -hmm. Like, right when you wake up. Oh, can I do this? Ugh, <laughs> well, she tried to challenge me to, like, every day get up, make a yeah. smoothie, or a shake, or whatever. 
I think they're technically smoothies, but whatever. Yeah. But she was like, challenge yourself to do that every single day, right when you wake up. Guys, I don't hit, I still hit snooze, but it's not nearly as bad. <laughs> and yeah. I'm waking up so much more, or like earlier, yeah. and I feel energized, and I'm like really loving this. So I'm going to keep doing it, because I'm feeling great right now. I'm trying to decide, I got these like Happy Mail critters in Itty Bitty, and for my stitch fix, I guess... Ooh, is that? There's thunder. Oh man! I knew it was gonna rain this week, but I didn't know it was. I gonna do I this thought we were gonna rain tonight. Yeah. I knew it was gonna rain tomorrow. Did it rain today at all? Yeah, no. sprinkled and then pretty, pretty good, like steady rain. Yeah. For a while. Thank you for not treating me like I'm an idiot. Sometimes people are like, uh, yeah, like I should know. Well, yeah, like, no, I like sleep. it definitely didn't. I storm. I slept good, so I feel like it probably rained. <laughs> It didn't storm, so it wouldn't have woken you up. All right, little stitch fix box there. I get to take my dogs to the vet. They're gonna love me. <laughs> okay, what next? Oh yeah, I need my little CPR guys. So we have a, where we take our dogs, there's I think like three different veterinarians that work there. Mm -hmm. And I personally really like one of them because I'm usually the one that takes the dogs to the yeah. vet. Oh, that rain. You can hear it. <laughs> but I'm usually the one that takes them to the vet. And so I've, I've picked her out and my dogs really like her and everything was going really well with her. And then I leave for 12 weeks. And my oh, husband no. takes them to the wrong vet. Like oh, the no. same place, but the wrong like veterinarian. I will CPR, guys. Oh my <laughs> goodness. It actually makes me want to do my CPR. Well, yeah, because now it's in there and you have and to do it, cute. so you might as well. Yeah. He anyway. took them to the wrong vet. Oh, no. And this is one that my dogs bark a lot and they growl and they're kind of... They're little miniature dachshunds, so they think they're really vicious and they're really not. <laughs> yeah. But they want to think. Yeah, short man syndrome. <laughs> yes, they want to think that they are massive dogs. Aww. Well, I had to take them. I had to take my dog Linus into him one time because he, like, his face was swollen and, like, I didn't know what was going on. This doctor, like, came in and he, my dog starts barking immediately. Oh, no. And he stands in the corner and is like, I'll have to examine your dog from here because I'm not going to get close to a dog that I'm not familiar with. And oh, I'm like, boy. are you, you are the vet. Yeah. Like, he's, he will not bite you. I actually can, like, swear on my life, he will not bite you. I get that he had to, like, be cautious of himself, but, like, I can legitimately tell you that he's not going to bite. Wow. But he stood there, like, he touched my dog once, I think, and my dog, like, was just very set off Well, and then it. once people act like that, then the dog's, like, really... Yeah. Like, I know this with my cats. Like, if you kind of act timid or scared or whatever, then they kind of, like, sense that. He wanted If they, if they know nothing. that you don't like them, they're not going to like you. Yeah. You know? No, Linus, at that point, wanted nothing to do with this guy. And then, so Drew takes him to this to the guy, and Drew's like, I don't know what you were complaining about. He's perfectly fine. Dogs are fine. I'm like, well, great. I'm so glad that they were fine. But I want to go back to the girl because she was so much more calm, and she worked with our budget. Like, she just, like, yeah, very professional from the first time I met her. And, yeah, uh, our, we have a vet appointment this on the 28th. So I asked my husband, like, who'd you schedule it with? He goes, well, probably the same guy. And I was like, well, that's not happening. Nope. <laughs> so I called them, and I was like, I need to change it. I didn't tell them why. Like, I didn't want to be, like, that person who's like, I just need a different person. But I was like, I just would prefer to work with the other vet. And then the lady was like, oh, well, actually, she's going to start taking over that evening time slot that week. And I was like, well, hot dog. Yeah. And I was like, I don't that's even awesome. have to worry about it. All right, so I had to improvise for my on-call because I forgot I'm on-call for my other job. So I just used a half box on that, and then I'm gonna use my on-call sticker. Oh, the struggle. 
Grab my handy dandy work stickers. I have like thousands of sheets of those. And it's fantastic. There was one thing that I noticed. Tasia did like, she was on a kick where she was doing a whole bunch of script stuff. Yeah. And she came out with, um, she came out with speech therapy yes. stickers. But no occupational therapy, right. no physical therapy. And I was like, wait, where are all the other therapies? I, I think she just should have like a therapy in general instead of saying speech. Well, yeah, because, because then, then you, you could, could use, use it, it for, for like psych therapy. Exactly. That's like what I was thinking. Hypotherapy. Yeah. There's like a ton of different other therapies that. Right. Yeah. I feel definitely got the short straw on that. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking the same thing. It's like maybe just therapy and then you could put whatever next to it, you know, mm -hmm. to turn it into what you want. But I think that just to cover the little bit of space that I have. I mean, sometimes like just a girl's night could be therapy. <laughs> right. <laughs> My husband used to go when he was off Sunday, Monday, um, like when I met him for several years before. And then even after that, um, he had a group of guys that they would always meet at this bar on Mondays and they called it therapy. So, uh, that's what he yeah, always said, I have, like, it is. I have therapy on Mondays, and that's just, that's just what we called it. Okay, work stickers are on. Okay, but now it's just a little... This is so pretty, I like it. It's making me very happy. Yes. Like, it I actually... It is doing its job. I want some cotton candy. Right? I want a um, unicorn. <laughs> okay, now things. I get to do my sidebar. I'm really excited for this meal plan. I went to Target today. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> uh, that hedgehog? Yes. That is the cutest thing in the world. I thought so too. So it's like, it's a stuffed hedgehog and it has a sequin back, like the, the flip sequins that, um, like on pillows and other and things. And you can sticker it up if you yes, want. Yes, it came <laughs> with that stickers. That was so cool. <laughs> so it was like originally $20, I think, and it was on sale for six. Wow. And so I got it for, for work. Well, I mean, like, I'm going to open it up first and play I'm, with it. I'm a clearance bargain shopper, too. Like I know where all the sections are. I think my yep. husband thinks that I'm nuts, but I'm yep. like, I'm not paying full price for this. It'll eventually go oh, on for clearance. Sure. I know. My husband's like, did you really need that or did you buy it because it was yep. on sale? And I was like, both. Needed it. But, yeah, so I got that. But they had a unicorn one that looked just like it. <gasps> was it on sale, too? It was. They were all on sale. You should have got the unicorn. I know, but I like the little hedgehog because <laughs> he's, he's more, he could be for boys or girls. And Which I, Target were you at? The Legends? Nope. I went to the one in Olay Olathe. Park. Olathe. Oh, okay. Because I had lunch like with my husband at Ranchito. 119th Street. Okay. okay, I was like, I have no idea where I was. Was it in like the toy section clearance? Because now I kind of want to no. get one for it my nieces. It was more in the crafting area it was like on the bottom shelf interesting i want to say it was in the row with crayola interesting okay. yeah it was a very random spot and right. it actually rang up as a craft kit on the receipt oh well okay but yeah they had a unicorn one it was really cute too Did they just have one or they have more unicorn like more oh unicorn. there was like three unicorns oh, okay because yeah. my nieces they love those sequin pillows that you can like draw yeah. on and stuff you know they would love and this. They are seven and six, so yeah, they would totally love it. Cause it said that you could um, that you could move the stickers like around. Mm. I don't know how. They're vinyl stickers. Yeah, I don't know how it works, yeah. but that's cool. I don't know if I like my weekend banner there or not, but it's gonna stay there for now. I'm trying to think of how thick washi is, cause I'm gonna put washi down here. So, I'm, like, oh, underneath here. Do you want some of my washi just to mock? Oh uh, yeah, just so I can see how far down it is. Is it like this to... size? Yeah. Just so I can just I say just put it down light because I noticed it kind of peeled up when I pushed it down hard, it kind of peeled up some paper last on the last spread. Ooh, that was a loud one. Okay, I would have been right. Okay. Maybe stuck to my unicorn. Thank you. Yeah. So, Creating & Co. just came out with some washi, and it's kind of like, it's a set. There's like a book washi, and I then like saw. A, the galaxy. It yeah. would have been perfect with this. I saw it. I ordered I like, it, oh, but it's not. interesting. Yeah, it's not going to be here in time. 
I mean, it might be here in time to add. She, that's the one thing about her. She has pretty quick shipping too. Um, yeah, her, her stuff came. Her and Sweet Quiet Design are the fastest shops I think ever. Oh, and then EBGB stickers. I've gotten stuff from her before and she is quick and she always sends me extras. Nice. So she's amazing too. Yeah, I felt like, because that was the first time I had ordered from Creating & Co. Yeah, she turns her stuff around pretty quick. Oh, man. Okay. All right, let's pretend like I'm still going to be doing my ab challenge when this week rolls around. You might be. I'm playing on it. will be. I will be. <laughs> what else? I don't have plans for Saturday or Sunday, so it's just kind of like laying down stickers at this point. Yeah. I'm hoping that the weather is nice and my husband's skydiving because that means I can kind of do whatever I want to do. But yeah, I won't know until it happens. I know. that's why It was like nice having my husband home for two extra days even though I had to work. I mean, and even though he was sick. But I was kind of like, are you going back to work tomorrow? Because <laughs> I kind of want to do my own thing. Like, you know, it's just hard to like do this and have girl time with him like hovering like what you doing what's that what's and plus if he's sick or trying to play video games in the background whatever I don't know oh that's why this week has been so great because I I get you hide your own time yeah, yeah while he's gone so when he yeah. gets home from work I'm like I have time for you <laughs> I guess that is one perk for me like of us having such opposite schedules and non-traditional schedules yeah is, like I mean it's very, like, when we actually spend time together, it's very sacred because it doesn't always happen. But we do each have good amounts of alone time. So mine's my evenings mm -hmm. before I go to work. And then his are um, nights. He comes home and I'm not here. So yeah, it works that's out, you know? Balance. Yeah. But that's the whole thing. That's why, like, I'm very strategic on the days I work. So it's like, we only have two days that we see each other. So right. I try not to work those two days. If I don't have to. We've always kind of been like that. We've always been pretty opposite. And we've always made it work. So I think, actually, I think that's what our secret is. <laughs> that's why we stay together. We well, we only sleep in out. the same bed at the same time, three times a week. <laughs> and it, it just works for us. Yeah, it's funny. We were, somebody was, we were talking about something and one of my friends and we were talking about basically like having a baby and like how you'd keep the bassinet in your room like at the beginning uh -huh. I was like oh yeah our bedrooms our master bedrooms really nice and big so that'll be really nice and he's like wait 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 back up <laughs> we're not having a baby in our room I said yeah you do for the first couple of months why and I was like well that way when you get up to feed them and I don't know I said especially first time parents it's just kind of like a they're That's just close you and you know yeah so you don't have to get up keep checking on them or you make sure you hear them and because they need to eat yeah and he's like oh no you and the baby can go sleep somewhere else so i can get my sleep and i looked at him he's like, i'm kidding i'm kidding yeah <laughs> i shot him a death glare <laughs> it was really funny you let me know how that works out for exactly you. that's exactly what i was thinking like i'll kick you me and the baby out the room i'll kick you out to the couch <laughs> buddy See how you like that. You come back on the second night once your back is killing you. <laughs> Craziness. Okay. Oh, I wish I had a day off because there's four day off stickers. <laughs> Dang it. They I are. do like the canceled and the not happening and the yeah, right. Like I miss having those because I feel like I don't have enough of those stickers when something happens. I like the script stickers better than those blocks, so. And yeah, she, she I does, do. She switches them up a yeah. lot, so. You're right, the newer ones do. But see, there's these, though, too, in here. The canceled and. Okay, uh, well, she just was being really Yeah, there's, generous. like, the really fancy, like, font ones now. So, yeah. I really like, yeah, the this cursive one has a lot. looking one. Yeah. That one's my favorite. Okay, so, let's see. What little things can I put down there? this chubby little the unicorn budget. oh yeah last time we were talking about how she needs to do the unicorn yoga but with the chubbies the chubbies oh my gosh it'll be so cute chubby animal everything Let's laundry see. maybe i should put it at the bottom I'm trying to figure out what i want to cover up that dotted line with because i don't like it <laughs> don't like it at all I don't think I have anything. I have these like two awkward spaces 
But I think I'm just gonna layer in an icon and then write on the paper. Yeah. But I can't. Guys, I can't tell the future. I don't know what's going in that spot. Oh shoot, that's me every week. I never know what I'm doing. I kind of miss the change bedding sh stickers. I feel like I have so many of them. Um, I know, because I never used them, but then once they were gone, I missed them. Hmm. I might just white out that line. I don't know. I don't know what to do. The dotted line down there? Yeah, it's really driving me nuts. Like, I want to put my laundry down here, but I want to figure this That's out some first. It's a washi. I don't know what kind of washi I have. I'm sure I have something. <laughs> Um, do you... Ooh, I have the really skinny... Well, I guess the skinny is too skinny. Okay, let's see. You could definitely do that blue color. I wonder if I have like a... Um, you could do that. I wonder if I have like a... I want like a... Ooh, where's the oh. purple? I was thinking about that, but I want like this size. That's the same one, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to use that. I like that holographic with the yeah. rainbows. Cool. There. Where did I get this one from? There. Yeah. Mm, it was down here. But it's oh, it was down there. It's not going to fit right. I've got it all strategically in here. If I take too many rolls out, I get confused. Cool. I haven't even used this Simply Gilded. I get to open it. Woohoo! Oh my gosh, you are like done. Holy crap. This never happens. It never happens. Never I, happens. I farted around too much on this one, and now I can't even open it. No, because I was like, I'm doing this and this and this. Yeah, you were like on it this week. Now I'm trying to go through and see, like, I used to have a designated laundry day, but I don't really anymore. And Mine's that's either Friday problem. or Saturday. It kind of just depends on, like, if we have stuff going on Friday night, it usually doesn't happen until Saturday. Honestly, I usually start my laundry on Friday, and then I <laughs> finish it by Sunday. Like, it doesn't all happen the same day. I just usually mark down what day I start it. And then, like, cleaning... Yeah, cleaning, I don't have a... Um. I used to do a sidebar, like a cleaning schedule, mm -hmm. and then that's when I would use the cleaning icon, and like every day I would have something different that was my goal to clean, even if I didn't quite get it done. Well, I used to do, like daily cleaning was up in my... Yeah, you did. And I had a whole spreadsheet that I would sit there and okay, work through, but then just like too many times over and over again, I just... Nope, I wasn't hitting it, yeah. and... Just kind of making me angry. Oh, I had the bees. You ended up finding yours. I'm like, I I don't know how mine with me, but I definitely oh, do the, have them with the me. Oh, the die cuts. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that washi is really pretty in here. Ooh. Now I know what's going down here. There you go. Do you want some? No. Why don't you just use it? You can just use I it. Have, I have it at home. Okay. Can't use liquid gold. Well, you know, it's going to take me a long time to use this, and I've got two rolls of this one in different sizes. Tasha, That's we need so more washi pretty. cards. More washi cards. So, one of my friends in Australia, <laughs> she missed the re-release of the, or the couple washi cards that they put out, mm. and she was, like, so bummed, and I sent her a washi card, because I could get away with it in just, like, a stamped envelope or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it took like a month to get there, but she opened it and she was like, sent me this huge <laughs> page if you're watching, hello. She sent me this huge long thing about, oh my gosh, planner friends are the best friends. I can't, See, that's everyone. literally the <laughs> nicest thing somebody's ever done for me. And I'm like, girl, it's no big deal. Everyone needs a dark shell. Aww. I just realized that I was probably oh. out of frame. Oh, yep, me too. Sorry guys. Again. <laughs> hey, but you can see it all now. Yeah. Okay. I'm all, I'm getting there. No, you're fine, because I'm... Oh, where do I want this fat little unicorn? Let's move her over just a bit. And straight. Peggy. Peggy. Her name is Peggy. No, it's not. It is. What is... No, what is it for real? It's Peggy. She commented. She said it was Peggy. I thought it was something else, and we were just calling her Peggy. No. No, because I said, but what is her name? And Tasha was like, it's Peggy, it is Peggy. I thought it was Petunia. Petunia's the hippo. Petunia's the hippo. What the hell? I swear we saw another name, and I was like, oh, that's what the name is. Hmm. No, it's Peggy. Peggy. I mean, Peggy fits. It totally I'm fits. I'm going to go search it now. Go search. Group. While I'm finishing up, go Peggy. look for Peggy. 
Because I know we had that discussion. I swear somebody else was like, oh no, it is this actually. Oh shit, I didn't want my RQI there. Just search for Peggy. <laughs> okay, I gotta move this one down. I don't think that's gonna help me trying to figure this wow, out. Well, if there's any Peggy's in the group. <laughs> I know. Well, I don't think it. there. There is one. There is one Peggy. Peggy, really? I see you. Or at least one Peggy that's posted. Gosh, I can't even remember what that was on. Favorite character? I don't remember. I just remember seeing the discussion. I wonder if I search me. I mean, I post in there a lot, but... Not as much as some people. <laughs> you guys know who you are. <laughs> Ooh, someone just posted in the group. Am I allowed to ask for YouTube channels that feature SKD in any format? Uh, yeah. That's us! <laughs> Do you want to share mine, too? Yeah, I'll share your then. link. That's cool. I mean, How I found that out, I have no idea. Why did I that have... pull up with my name? I wonder... I don't know. <gasps> oh, because someone already got us. Oh, Yay! yeah. Who Brand was that? Brandy. Thanks, Brandy. Yeah, Thanks she's like... on top of it. Yeah, she already got us covered. Thank you Aww, so much. Oh, Brandy. Shout out, Brandy. Yeah, that's awesome. She's one that always watches us, and I like it. Yes, she's always commenting. We appreciate it, girl. Okay, I gotta figure out where I'm gonna put my little Pilates chick. I didn't save her. Maybe I gotta do another another Pilates move here because this one's not working. I post in here way too much. This is not even in order anymore. Uh, no, it's not too much, right? No. Okay, that's gonna have to be Keisha. my Pilates chick. You posting me, commenting, me, 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 me. Okay, what else am I gonna do? I gotta put something else down. Crap, crap, crap. Kayla Lada, Peggy? Was it in the go wild? Oh, okay, yes. Yes, it's in here. I'm gonna find it. I'm going to do this, even if it takes me off camera like 800 times to figure it out. Go through all of the 331 Ooh. comments. Um, sorry guys, I'm like so unorganized, but I have to figure out, I started getting another meal subscription service, because I used to get HelloFresh every plate. I saw that one. It's super cheap. If you want a link, I'll give you a link, because it makes your first box like $3 a meal, or something, $3 a serving. Yeah. It's really cheap, and I'm pretty happy with it so far. Uh, oh, I mean, I haven't got it yet, but I'm pretty happy like with the menu and stuff. My first one comes Thursday. And then, let me see, am I getting one? No, I'm, I skipped the next two weeks because it was just, there's a lot of fish right now and I think it's just because of Lent. Because of Lent, yeah. And my husband and I don't eat fish, so. But I think it's gonna pick up. Okay, what else was I gonna do? I feel like I had something else to do. I don't know. It was when she was like giving away Go Wild tickets and she asked who your favorite character oh, was. Oh, yeah. Did she take that post down? No, it's still there. Who won the tickets? Did she announce uh, it? I don't... It's in there, yeah. I saw a whole bunch of people saying, like, congratulations. Well, I know it wasn't me, obviously. It wasn't me either. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't remember seeing... Oops. Seeing okay. a winner. Hands down, George is my favorite, especially when he's eating socks. And then you say, Petunia, not Peggy. And then I said, Petunia is the hippo, right? What is the unicorn's name? She laughs and she says, Peggy is the unicorn. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Dang. Because I commented on that, right? Yes, yeah. I don't think I ever got notifications because I don't remember reading that. Yeah, because you said... Yeah, because you said I said Petunia. Petunia. That's what I thought it was. And then when she commented, I never got that notification. Yeah. Peggy's Peggy, Peggy, okay. I've been calling it the Stand right corrected. <laughs> I thought you made it up, but it fit. I was like, yes, I'm totally for Peggy. It works. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so while I'm on here... I'm Brandy. staggering these boxes here. Yeah, she said, you and Kayla have great SKD videos. When was that videos. post originally? Was it a while like ago? an hour ago. Oh. Yeah. Cool. While we I were feel, sitting here. I feel like I saw somebody else post 
So you should tell her thanks for filming as we speak. I know I'm getting ready to say because it was Bridget who posted and said, I have an inkwell press for my life stuff, but also have an EC teacher planner for homeschooling oh. our seven kids. Oh, lady, you have wow, seven girl. kids. Props That's to you. That's amazing. Yeah. And homeschooling, all of that. Actually, I thought your teacher planner is perfect because there are seven subjects, aren't there? In the teacher planner, I think there is. I don't there remember. Is. It's been a long time since I've had one. I hope you're interested to see how you use that, just for your homeschool stuff. The, yeah. The AC teacher planner. And then mm -hmm. our three oldest kids have PPPs. Three oldest kids have PPPs. What's a PPP? I don't know. <laughs> and Did then, Bridget say that? Yeah. Bridget, if you're watching, what's comment. A, what's, what's a PPP? A PPP? <laughs> <laughs> we need to be educated. And then she says, and I have been known to make my own pages to put into my 25 plus year old Franklin Covey. Covey? Covey. Right? Franklin yeah. Covey? What is, I don't know what that is though. Uh, so, it's a, like a well-known planner brand, I think, right? Yeah. I know I've heard the name I've heard before. the name, but I, know, I don't know what it, um, I don't know what it is. But yeah, and then Brandy commented us. So that's awesome. That's so I'm going to reply nice. right now. Thank you so much. That's awesome. We are doing a buddy plan as I type. <laughs> <laughs> and this entire interaction will be in the video. <laughs> so be sure to watch <laughs> coming up in a couple weeks. <laughs> that's awesome. Monkey with the eyes covered because that's my favorite. Yes, movie. I love that one too. Okay, so yeah. Are you done? I'm all done. I think... I just kind of stagger the half boxes and then I'll do like a character sticker on the opposite of it so it'll mm -hmm. look oh, that's gonna better look once so it's good. filled in. Oh, I can't wait to see that. That's going to actually so, look really cool. Because I was like, I don't know how to do that space, but I like these boxes and there's tons of them. Yeah, this yeah. is like loaded with half boxes, minimal on the quarter boxes. Loaded with functional full boxes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, good. I don't have any quotes in here. I think that's a first for me. I like it though. So, well, and I use the two that actually, well, and I use that one too. So I use like different stickers than you did yeah. completely. Oh, you um, used another important one. I did because oh, I have kindergarten transition meetings that entire, like all day. Oh, I have cool. three of them. There you so, go. Perfect. Yeah. But all okay. right. I think we're, I think we're in frame for the most part. The camera can't zoom out any more than that. So it is what it is, but there we go. All right, I hope this was a little bit more enjoyable for you guys than the last time it was on my channel and we were, like, not talking at all. But oh, yeah, using the craftsmith. <laughs> yeah, so we will be doing this again. I know we will be. In April, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, so what kits would you yes. guys like to see us do this? Throw out some, some suggestions and we'll take the top two. How about that? Yeah, that would be a lot of and fun. And I was going to say, we have... If, if there's an older mystery kit, there's a chance we might have it, right? Right, or pieces of it. Or pieces of it. And then any of the Plan With Me kits. Yep, because we can always order. We're going to order on a freebie Friday, though, guys. So. And chances are <laughs> I probably already have it. So, yeah. <laughs> so, so throw out your suggestions for us and uh, let us know what you guys want to see us plan with. Yeah, that way we that can all plan together. So what a great idea, Kayla. <laughs> all right, guys. I'll have everything linked below in the description for all of Darshell's social media and the video from last week. But thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Bye.